Okay, Christy here, uh, and today we're going to do a quick video on how to create a support ticket for my paying ads. Um, sometimes it can be very confusing, um, especially since the program has gone through so many changes since the um, original video, which they may or may not be using. I don't know what they're using, but um, I know that the system has gone through some changes. So this is the process now for how you create a support ticket. The very first thing that you want to do is you want to log in. You have to be logged in to your account in order to create a support ticket that's going to be correctly attached to you and your account. I hope that makes sense. So do not click on this support button here on the main page. Uh, first you want to log in uh, to your account. So once you log in, the first thing that you're going to have to do is sit through the login ad for 20 seconds and once that's done then we will have a link where we can um, uh, create our support ticket okay so we're going to go ahead and click on continue to my paying ads and that's going to take us to our overview page okay so here on our overview page we have our support link and we're going to click on that that's going to take us to our support page where you might have some tickets or not. It doesn't matter, um, but you're going to add a new right here. You're going to click on Add New, and that's going to take you to a page where you have to click three banners in order to proceed further. So we need to click on three banners, and as each banner, um, each ad is um, displayed for 10 seconds, and once that is done, it will say thank you for viewing this ad. And you click here on go back to pay per click page. And you see that we have clicked on one banner. So we're going to come down here and we're going to click on another banner. And that's going to take me to a page where it's going to display the ad for 10 seconds. And once that is through, then we're going to click one more time on go back to pay per click. Uh, uh, pay-per-click page. You see it says here, thank you for viewing this ad. Go back to pay-per-click page and it says you have clicked two banner ads. Okay, so now we need to click one more ad. We're going to click one more ad and that's going to view. You see it's working up here in the tab. You have to be patient. I'm not sure why. There we go. Now it's going to view the ad it's going to display the ad for 10 seconds and then we're going to go back one last time to our pay per click page as soon as this is done here. Thank you for viewing this ad. Go back to pay per click page and now it says you have clicked three banner ads. Now at this point we're going to click this support button and that's going to take us back to our original page where we're going to once again click on add new and that is going to take us to a page where we can set up our actual support ticket and you can see up here in the tab that it is working on loading the page now we do get a lot of traffic on this website I'm surprised that most of the time it loads as fast as it does um, every once in a while you will have situations where it will seem to take some time to load a page. 99.9% .9 of the time this site loads amazingly fast for as many members as we have that are active on this site that are constantly surfing, purchasing. Alright, now that has not loaded a page so we're going to click refresh. There we go. Now once I clicked refreshed, then it brought me to this page where I can set up my support ticket. Now the first thing that we have to do is we have to select our category. So you always want to make sure that you look for your category. And this particular one, 
Uh, let's see, we have sponsor issue, password issue, security question, and answer issue, earnings or commissions issue, payment processor issue, missing purchases, seed money balance crediting, sign up problem, guidance needed, withdrawal related, setting up an advertisement, reservers advertisement, reserved advertisement, other issues not listed above, cancellation of withdrawal request, multiple account, surfing contest, memberships related. So let's go ahead and select seed money balance crediting. Um, a lot of folks that are needing to set up um, support tickets right now, um, they have, uh, they're late in the game. Uh, they miss their window of opportunity to take care of transferring their money from PayPal to their preferred processor. And um, so now they have to have um, support help them do that. And so um, I would say that that would probably be seed money balancing crediting, trying to get that money uh, balance into your preferred processor. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and click that, and then for the subject, you know, whatever your subject is, um, transferring money from PayPal to my preferred processor, and there should be two R's, okay? And I need assistance with moving my seed money from PayPal to my processor. And then you might let them know, um, you know, what your preferred processor is. Um, I don't know specifically what information they need. Uh, but this will get the, um, the process started, and they can let you know what they need. So at this point, then, you're going to click Submit. What that's going to do is then that is going to, I don't want to create a ticket. So we're going to go back to my support page. It's going to create a ticket ID. So it's going to create a, a ticket like this. You're going to have your category your um, subject and um, the date, all this information. You're going to take this ticket ID number here and you're going to copy this right here. You're going to copy that and then you're going to come over to um, you're going to come over to the Facebook page and in the Facebook page you're going to scroll down until you find the support thread. The support thread has this image attached to it. It was created by Uday on July 9th. And you are going to add your ticket ID just like this. All you want in there is just the ticket ID. You don't need to write any explanations. You don't need to add anything onto it whatsoever. Just your ticket ID. And then um, the support folks are very good at working through this list and getting people taken care of. Um, so that's it. That is how you create a support ticket. Um, if you have questions, make sure and leave them in the comments, and I will try to assist you in any way that I can. Um, have a great day. Bye-bye.